All right, good morning, everybody. Hope you're having a wonderful start to your Wednesday. Halfway through the work week, and I know a lot of kiddos, teachers finally getting back into the swing of things. Jacket's going to be needed. I even grabbed the big puffy coat this morning because it's going to be a rather cold couple of days. Now, what we're going to be lacking is moisture. We've got this low pressure system that's to our south, and it's going to bring in more cloud cover as the day moves forward, but it's not necessarily going to be bringing in a whole lot of precipitation. We may see a little bit of a wintry mix or a few isolated showers in the far southern valley. That's going to be for today. Not really banking on it. And then we've got this cold front, this little clipper system that's going to bring in the opportunity for maybe a few isolated flurries across the higher elevations. Again, not overly impactful for us here across East Tennessee. There's just a lot of moisture lacking with this system. We're not lacking a lot of moisture with our next low pressure system that is forecast to slide into the area starting as early as Friday night, carrying on into the weekend. So it's going to be a little bit of a messy weekend, folks. We're watching again very light precipitation starting to roll on into the area as we go into your Friday night. These showers will stick with us as we go into your Saturday, and then we're watching the chance for even more rain as we go into the early part of next week. So we're entering into what will be a little bit of a busier pattern. This here in particular is a long range model. So it primarily shows rain here across East Tennessee, a rather cold rain. We could start off initially with a little bit of a wintry mix, but I don't foresee any uh, really impactful winter like weather. That's going to be primarily to our north where we do have a little bit more of a colder temperature profile, but the higher elevations on the back half of this low pressure system could provide the opportunity for some wintry weather across the higher elevations. That's going to take us into your Sunday. Then next week, Monday into Tuesday, just kind of putting this into your little tab in the back of your head, we do have the chance for more rain arriving into the early part of next week.